monkey care packages range from tier 0 all the way up to a tier 5. There's also a random tier and a random tier light. I'm not allowed to ever upgrade a tower, so whatever tower I get is the tower I'm stuck with. Hey guys, I just want to let you know that today's video is sponsored by Rise of Kingdoms. Have you ever wondered what it's like to be a Greek emperor and conquer the world? Or maybe creating a beautiful Japanese empire. Rise of Kingdoms is an epic cross-platform strategy game that takes players on an immersive journey through various historical eras. In Rise of Kingdoms, you can choose from 14 historical civilizations that have truly existed, famous generals and unique military units from different civilizations will follow your every command as you build your own legends on the battlefield. Not only that, with an expansive open world environment, players can explore and conquer new lands. The game has more than 60 million users and has gained over 100 million downloads worldwide. Rise of Kingdoms welcomes the arrival of the new Greece civilization. Featuring exclusive commanders and special units, our Graspides, adding a new level of excitement to the game. Personally, my favorite thing about this amazing game is the attention to detail with all the different civilizations. You really feel like you're a part of the civilization you choose, with the awesome architecture, units, and feel of the empire you rule. Not to mention, there will be a special event allowing players to compete for their own civilizations with a chance to win special prizes. So what are you waiting for? Download Rise of Kingdoms now by clicking the first link in the description or pinned comment, or scanning the QR code if you're a new New player. Don't forget to use the promo code GREASE4ROK for 20 silver keys. Participate in the new Civilization class event by clicking the second link via ROK Games and fight for your civilizations and win special prizes. See you on the battlefield. Oh my goodness, I can literally only buy a tier zero. So it costs almost $600. All right, let's see what we get for our first tier. Okay, Boomerang Monkey is not too bad. Let's see, a boomerang monkey costs 300? Oh wait, okay, so this boomerang monkey actually costs double what it's normally worth. I feel like tier zeros are really bad, right? So the default price of it is 600, but most towers are like less than 600, right? I guess you could get like a, like a super monkey. If you got a super monkey right off the bat, that would be super lucky actually. I don't think I'm gonna be able to afford a tier one tower. So I think I just have to save up and try to just, I'm just losing lives. I need to get, oh my gosh, I literally need one dollar to get the next one. Okay, come on, give me something good. Give me something good to eat. Okay, a spike factory is not bad. Spike factory costs $930. So I actually made some money. I actually made the money back that I originally spent. So far, we're kind of even right now. The spike factory is going to be doing good. Now, remember, I'm not allowed to upgrade this. So I actually can't put any down, which is going to make for an interesting strategy, right? I really want to save up and get like a tier one. And this is where it gets interesting, right? Because a T1, there is a chance that it could have multiple T1s, right? And this, so it could have like a, there is a possibility, right? If I buy this T1 tower for a thousand dollars, that I end up getting something crazy like a super monkey with laser blasts and knockback, right? Which is like a $6,000 tower for only $1,000. So that's actually a really strong thing that we can get. Or I could end up getting like a dart monkey with like something really bad. Like I get a dart monkey with quick shots, which is like $500, right? So it's all very random what you end up getting. I'm doing pretty good right now, actually. This is where it comes down to the strategy. Do I just save up and try to get a crazy good tower and get a T2? Or do I get T1 towers? It's an extra $700 for a T2, right? And I could get something re I feel like T2s aren't really the strategy, right? I feel like we get T1 towers. That's an extra $700 and we're already losing. So let's just put down this T1 tower. Please, something good. Okay, okay, in okay, sentry gun and oversized nails. So that was a thousand dollars. Sent this is four hundred dollars, that's five hundred dollars, and that's four hundred and eighty-five. That is actually a net positive. That is a net positive. We actually made some money on that. I'm okay with this outcome. This outcome is very nice. Now the real question is, do I get another one? Do we okay? We could sell this for like seven hundred dollars. I'm gonna sell this. I'm gonna get rid of this and then maybe I can get another thing. 
I'd love to get like a banana farm, right? Because the main problem is getting the money for these. Do I get another T1 or do I get a T2? I think I stick with T1s until I can afford a T3. So let's put a T1 right here, right on the edge. A submarine with longer range and twin guns? That is definitely worth it. Well, twin guns, long range. Okay, maybe that's not. That actually turns out to be about $1,000. But we now have a submarine here. So I'm actually pretty happy. Again, there could always be way worse towers that we get, right? Like there could always be way worse towers. We have nothing to pop lead balloons. Yeah, we can't pop lead balloons right now. I, oh no, oh no, we can't pop lead balloons. We can hit camos thanks to this beautiful tower. So, do, okay, we need to make sure we can pop lead balloons. All right, I'm gonna just hope that this tower can pop lead balloons. Please pop lead balloons, please. I'm putting it down, please, please, please. No, it was one off. Okay, well, do I just spam T1 tower or T0 towers? Okay, glue gunner, uh, what is this? A sniper, oh no. I'm selling these towers. It gives, us, it gives me a little bit of money. It gives me just a teensy weensy amount of money. Do I get a T2? Okay, this, I'm putting down a T2. This T2 is gonna be able to pop leads. It will. In three, two, one. No, it's just smart spikes. I gotta sell it. I have to sell it. I have to, oh my gosh. I'm not getting anything that can pop leads. It's just a village. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. I'm running out of money. I have no way to pop leads. That's just a banana farm. Uh, I, I have, oh no, 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 no. I have to pop leads. I have to, uh, does this pop leads? That doesn't pop leads. Um, that doesn't pop leads. No way. Oh my gosh. Am I going to lose? I think I'm going to lose. I think I can, uh, uh, oh my gosh. I actually lost. I have to restart. Ah, all right, let's do this. Oh my gosh. A bomb shooter. The first tower that I put down. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? The first, literally the first tower that I buy and I get a bomb shooter? What kind of joke is this? What kind of sick joke is this? That's such a prank. Please be something just saucy. Oh, a monkey ace, nice. All right, so let's put them right here. All right, some, please something good. An alchemist, an alchemist with larger potions. This is good, this is good. We have more lead popping, po oh, we have literally Two out of the three towers that I just put down can pop lead balloons. Either one of these towers and we would not have lost. I'm not gonna lie. I'm a, I am a little upset at that. Did I get another T1? Yeah, we're kind of struggling. I'm gonna put down another tower. Another alchemist? Are you kidding me? Okay, this is crazy. How am I getting so many alchemists? We've got a lot of AOE actually. Like it's not too bad. It's just a little ridiculous that I've all of these lead bobbing towers. I guess I'm just gonna get another T1. Yeah, we'll look at this. We're already losing more lives. Please give, give me something that just pops towers. Oh, oh, that's amazing. Oh, we got a Darling Gunner. Look at that. And the Darling Gunner ended up being in such a good spot. Oh my gosh, no camo detection either. That's kind of sad. Oh, we are still losing low, which is like really bad. Uh, do you think there's any way we can save up to a T3? I don't think getting a T3 is gonna be possible. I don't think it. I don't think it's gonna work out for us. I think I have to just get a T2 and hope for the best. Please, please T2 be good. Please be good. Please. Oh, oh, bigger jets, faster firing. Okay, lock in place. Let's have this guy lock. Let's have him like locked right here. Or what if we lock him right here? Okay, yeah, 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 because he's able to just like... Okay, nice, nice, nice. And oh yeah, oh yeah, okay. Okay, now we get to save up for a T3. And hope, and hope that a T3 is gonna do well for us. I would love to be able to afford a T3, but it could be a really bad T3. But it could also be a really good T3. I just, oh, we have no camo detection. We have none? Okay, we have to get... Oh no 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 please like a ninja oh okay 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 all right I think that's gonna that's gonna take the day oh we would have lost if we didn't get that all right thank goodness we have some form of camo detection not a lot not a lot but we do have a spike factory good we have a Moab in five rounds 
We have a Moab in five rounds. Oh no. I can buy a T3. Please, 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 please be good. Oh, it's Shimmer. I got a Shimmer. Oh my gosh, a Shimmer Wallifier. Okay, I'll, I actually will take that. I will take that as a T3. It decamos and puts down Wall of Fire. I'm so happy with that. So now the question is, do we try to get a random tier light? No, because we can get this, we can get a T3 for like the same price. Can we pop a Moab in this current state? I don't know if we can or not. With another T3, I think we're gonna be okay. Another, another random T3. All right, something good, something real good. Mortar Monkey. I don't want a Mortar Monkey. Mortar Monkey's so bad. I'm selling Mortar Monkey to try to get a new tower. I think that's worth it. It's not worth it. Okay, come on. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. A Plasma Bass Robo Monkey? We spent 3,000 on that? Laser Blast 2,000. Robo Monkey 7,000? Oh, my gosh. That is... Oh, my... Look at this. Oh. Oh, that feels so good. That feels... So good to get that. I'm happy. I, that was, that was the luck that we needed. It was getting, phew. And we have our shimmer. Oh, okay. I do want a more reliable form of camera detection though. So let's see if I can try to get a T4. I think if we can get a T4, $8,000. T4s are a hit or a miss. Like, I feel like $8,000 for a T4 is pretty respectable actually. That seems like the best. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, purple camos. Okay, not good. Okay, T4. Let's sell some of these towers. Like, okay, that this guy can go, that guy can go. This heli pilot. Let's just have it locked in place up there. So, like, look at it. He's just gonna get more pops. He's gonna be doing some good work. Uh, this guy is 2,000 pops. We can he can stay. Okay, eight T4. Let's see what we get for our T4. And three, two, one, go! Blade Maelstrom. Wait. Does it go through? Hmm. Is Blade Maelstrom worth it? Is that worth four thousand dollars? What is Blade? That's not worth. That's not worth it. Is it worth it? Let's see. How strong of an ability? It's not worth it. I'm selling it. I'm not. I'm. Uh oh. Uh oh. Purple camos. Purple camos. <gasps> Monkey pirates. Oh my gosh. Purple camos though. We need more camo detection. I'm very glad we have monkey pirates there. That's actually so nice. All right, I want to try to get the random tier. So this one, it says random tier light. So it's completely random what we get. It could be a sun god temple or it could be just a dart monkey with no upgrades. So let's see. Not bad. Wait, for $3,000, that's really bad. I'm selling that. Give me something, give me something cool. Oh, a double gun? I'll take that, but we still don't have camo detection. We're still severely underformed in dealing with purple balloons and dealing with camos. Both of those are going to be the end of us if we're not careful, right? Like, if we don't have it under control, we're gonna be in big trouble. Let me go ahead and put this down. Okay, that's good. Deadly spikes? Deadly Spikes is actually really good because that can deal with camo purples. Let me get rid of this so we have a little bit more room to put down more random towers. Do I dare save up for a T5? That's $43,000. That's $43,000. That is outrageous, actually. For a T5? I feel like that is such a waste of money. Most T5s aren't even close to $43,000, right? Like, there's no way that is gonna work. This Shimmer Wizard has won us the game. Like, without it, we would be completely and utterly hopeless. And also the Robo Monkey. The Robo Monkey has also done quite a bit of work for us. All right, another T4. Let's see what we get. Three, two, one, and go. He can't even hit anything. Come on, Ice Monkey. All right, let's try that again. Three, two, one, boom. Another ice monkey! Are you serious? Actually, that's not too shabby, is it? I can harpoon that guy. Do I want this? Yeah, he seems to be doing okay. We can get another T4 as well. So let's go ahead and see what this T4's got for us. A transforming tonic? How much does transforming tonic cost? 4,000? That's not... I... I it, it sells for like such a small amount though. It's literally just this guy that gets transformed. I guess I'll just use it. I guess I'll just take advantage of it. I almost never use it anyway, so maybe it's time for me to like practice using 
total total transformation or transforming tonic. That's actually not bad. He's already got more pops than the Darling Gunner, so maybe maybe I maybe I uh, gotta give him more of a chance. Do I dare? Do I dare save up for a T5? Here's the thing. Here's the thing. Okay. I could take the easy road, right? And I think I think I could guaranteed I could get a W and beat round 100 pretty easily by just spamming down T4, right? Like I'm pretty sh I'm pretty sure that I could be able to beat the BAD in round 100 by doing that. But that's not fun. Okay? That's not fun. And I reject that. I reject that notion. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to save up to get the T5, which is 40 $3,000. So I could get, right, an anti bloom gunner, Legend of the Night, a true sun god temple. Right? Let's, okay, let's take a look at T5. So what is the normal, okay, bad, bad, okay, bad, bad. So any primary, uh, I, Moab domination would be good. Any, any bomb shooter would be good. A uh, middle path attack shooter. Just, uh, look, look, okay, I know, I know the possibility is, okay, wait, it's, one, two, I think there's 22 towers, okay? If there's 22 towers, three paths for each tower, okay? There is 66 T5 towers in the game, okay? So that means, that means if I spent $43,000, there is a 1 in 66 chance that I get Monkeyopolis, okay? There is a 1 in 66 chance that that happens. That I get Monkeyopolis, okay? That is $5,000, okay? And that is terrifying to think about. Uh, ooh, I don't I don't think I can get a T5 yet. I'm gonna get a couple T4s. All right, let's go ahead. Do we just want to get them back here, or... I guess we can get some right here. So, okay, I don't want a balloon impact, but I guess that stuns balloons. An overclock? I don't want an overclock. Oh, May Moab. Target strong. That might be able to help. I want to get just a random tier. It's $6,000. Let's see what we get. Give me something good. Come on. Come on. Don't mess with me. Oh my gosh, a Dark Champion! Oh my gosh, I can't believe I just got a Dark Champion from the random tier that's $6,000. Oh my gosh. I was, Okay, I'm good. I'm good. Let's go. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Okay. Now I'm, I'm good. Like, I'm good. I don't know if I'm good enough to be able to deal with like the crazy guys though. Snipe, I'm ah. having the main Moab is actually really nice to just like stun balloons, but he has no camo detection. I totally forgot that my monkey buccaneer can just like just grab ZOMGs. Not ZOMGs, but BFGs. He might be able to grab DDTs. Oh my gosh, he's getting a little bit further than I liked. Yeah, I cannot. Wait, can I? Wait, wait, can I get this? Oh my, wait, wait, what is his range? Wait, 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 wait. Dark shift is global? Wait. Wait, when did dark shift become global? Is that a new update? That is crazy. Wait, so I can just put my, I can literally just put them over here. Is there any towers that I, wait, how in the world does this ice monkey have a hundred thousand pops? Wait, a hundred thousand, this guy's actually clutching it. Wait, this ice monkey holds his, Literally, it's getting close to overtaking my Robo Monkey. What is that? All right, we only need ten thousand dollars more for Monkeyopolis. Okay, that's all we need. Twenty, ten thousand dollars, or not Monkeyopolis? No, I don't want Monkeyopolis. Okay, if I get Monkeyopolis, I'm not kidding. I'm gonna immediately just turn the recording off. The I, the video will just end abruptly. I want that there is no like oh thanks for watching guys oh you enjoyed the video ends okay it's a one in 66 chance that the video just ends if I get monkeyopolis okay I'm just I'm I'm just being honest with you guys okay time for the t5 tower everybody let's see what we get do we just put it like right here away from everybody that seems pretty bad but I'm down I have just one random team or do we put it right I'll put it right here okay Here's our T5 tower. Three, two, one, go! Oh my, super glue. That's so bad. That's so bad. Do I sell it? Is it worth selling? Do I, do I try selling it? Is it worth it? It's not bad. 
If I can get something that decamos DDTs, he'll actually be pretty useful. I'm just amazed that we got the this guy from the random tier. Maybe the random tiers are the way to go. Maybe that's actually the way better thing to do. I want to use another random tier. Those just seem to work out so well. Another Dark Knight! Okay, these are definitely the play. A Plasma Accelerator! Okay, I guess the Plasma Accelerator... Wait, where do we... I guess... Okay, let's just remove that so we actually have the range. And now we can just put the Plasma Accelerator there. Nice. Okay, random tiers have been super duper clutch. Like, super duper clutch. An Operation Dark Storm. What? Okay, the random tier is definitely the way to go. Like, it is, uh, it's not even close how far. Like, look at this, random tier. Okay, that's, never mind, that's not actually that good. I just gotta make sure I have my dark shift, like, on lock in case something happens. And I'm selling that, because I'm not, I'm not, I'm not using that. That's not happening. Another Robo Monkey, let's go. All right, we can sell this. I don't think that's worth it. I know that's not worth it. I know that's not worth it, come on. Oh, Moab Shuff. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I need to put Dark dark Shift over here. Whoa! Whoa, buddy! Whoa, if I didn't have Dark Shift, I still might be in trouble. All right, grab the Moab. Oh my gosh, thank goodness for Dark Shift. All right, you can Dark Shift back over here. Dark Shift's such a cool ability. Okay, come on, random tier, please. Okay, I just got to literally Dark Monkey to the random tier. Okay, round 100. Let's see what we got. All right, are we gonna be able to? Okay, uh, normal, just follow him here. Okay, can we absorb DDTs if you can't see camos? Let's see, come on. Okay, oh, whoops. Oh, the super glue! The super glue! Let's go! We defeated it! Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please hit that like button, subscribe, turn on notifications. You guys are awesome, and we'll see you tomorrow for some more awesome content. Peace.